Hi, I'm Dr. Sharon Allison Ida. You know me as Dr. Sharon. I am here with one of the nation's leading dermatologists, Dr. Lisa Ginn. Dr. Ginn, can you tell us a little bit about yourself and your practice? Sure. Um, my name is Dr. Ginn. My name of my practice is Skin at Large. It's a fairly new practice. We've been open for just over a year, as you know. And I do primarily cosmetic dermatology, but that really involves a lot of women issues. Adult acne, teenage acne. We're at a point in medicine where it's really exciting because for the longest therapies that were available for Caucasian skin or lighter skin types really weren't an option for our skin. Now on the right hands, we can do everything that we see offered for every other skin type on our skin. So I treat all ethnicities of patients, but as a woman of color, it's wonderful to actually be able to offer options to women of color. Everything from anti-aging to dealing with hormonal changes that begin in our 30s and continue through our 60s to just making you feel on the outside the way you do on the inside. So it's not about changing who you are. It's just about having what you see in the mirror reflect how you feel inside. So it's a wonderful time. There are a lot of great options and nothing is meant to change who you are. Those are not the patients I treat. I treat <laughs> patients who want to feel good but are feeling good about life in general. Dr. Gann, now I have to tell you I'm a little jealous of your perfectly flawless skin. <laughs> what would you tell persons that want to actually look their best? What are like top three things that women should do or just in general what you should do for your skin? Probably the biggest thing is something that we've been erroneously told that we do not need to protect from sun. That's mm -hmm. absolutely not true. Sun damage is real for our skin. It affects our skin very differently than it does for lighter skin types. Every person so no matter what your skin tone needs to be doing some form of sun protection. Of course, the most common thing is um, SPF, but then there are other things that are antioxidants that we're just starting to learn about that our skin benefits from, mm -hmm. as well as lighter skin types. Um, if I were to say the top three, sun protection, restoring collagen, which unfortunately we stopped making in our mid-30s, but we can turn the switch back on with a lot of it you can do at home. You don't need to do a lot of office procedures. And then the last thing is exfoliation and hydration, which again, you can do at home. So it's just about having someone who can guide you put together what's kind of your homework, if you will, because we never stop being students when it comes to our own body and learning, and you will be amazed at the way that you age. You can actually alter the way that you age, still look appropriate for wow. your age, but look fantastic. Wow. Makeup should definitely be an option. Right here with Dr. Lisa again. You had it. You didn't even go into the doctor's office, and you paid no copay. Right here with her getting excellent advice on skin care. Again, she's one of the nation's leading dermatologists. Dr. Gann, how can we reach you? Um, you can visit our website at www.skinatlrg.com or feel free to call our office at 301-656-5444. We're there five days a week. Thank you very much.